Good morning, dear students. How are you today? Today, I'm going to explain a new lesson. Our lesson is about can and can't. When do you use can? We use can to show ability that someone can do something. I can play, he can jump, she can drink juice, they can sleep early. Example one. What can you do? I can swim. Excellent. Example two. Look at that picture. What can he do? He can jump. Super. Example three. What can they do? They can run. Great job. Next. Can't. Can't is the negative form of can. Again, can't is the negative form of can. What does can't mean? Can't mean that someone doesn't have the ability to do something. One more time. What does can't mean? It means that someone doesn't have the ability to do something. Where do you add not? We add not after can. Again, we add not after can, so it will be can't. Examples, I can't fly. The baby can't ride. The bat can't see. The snakes can't jump. Look at example one. Can he swim? No. He can't swim. Excellent. Example two. Can the baby read? No. The baby can't read. Great job. Question. How do you start the question using can? We start the question using can at the beginning of the sentence. And a question mark at the end. One more time. How do you start the question using can? We start the question using can at the beginning of the sentence and a question mark at the end. Super. Examples. She can swim. Form a question. Put can at the beginning of the sentence. The first letter has to be capital. Great. What comes after can? She. What do you put at the end? Question mark. Super. So it will be can she swim?
How do you answer this question? We have two answers. The first answer will be, yes, she can. Or, no, she can't. This is the second answer. Example two. Ahmed can run. Form a question. Put can at the beginning. The first letter has to be capital. What comes after can? He. Great job. What do you put at the end? Question mark. So it will be can he run? How do you answer this question? We answer this question with Yes, he can or no, he can't. Example three, let's read together. The monkey can climb the tree. Form a question. What shall you do? Put can at the beginning. What do you put at the end? Question mark, super. What comes after can? The monkey. And what do you put at the end? Question mark, as I said before. So, the question will be, can the monkey climb the tree? What's the answer of this question? Yes, it can. Or, no, it can't. Great job. We sometimes use can to ask for permission. What the meaning of permission? For example, if I want to take my mom's permission to play with my friend, what shall I say? Look at the first example. Can I play with my friend? Yes, you can. Or, no, you can't. So, what's the meaning of permission? If I want to take my mom's permission to play with my friend, what shall I say? Can I play with my friend? Good job. Example two. Can we drink some water? Yes, you can. Or, no, you can't. Thanks for watching and good luck.